Guys, it's Kat. I know there are a lot of mink videos out there, but I've had a couple of people ask me lately how to use the mink, especially the mini mink. And I have some um, pattern paper that I bought from Joann's, and it's the Heidi Swap. Oh, what is this called? I don't think it has a name. But this is what it looks like, and this is the information right there. And it's 12 by sheet, 12 sheets of toner cartridge, and I cut them down to six by six. And there's two of each sheet, so I ended up with eight of each design. And these are some of the designs that you get. Oops, I'm skipping past some of them. So there's a lot of designs, and I got them on sale, so it was a really good deal. So eight sheets of every design if you cut them down to six by six. So then I took some deco foil, which comes in these little sheets like this, and they are six by twelve, and you get five sheets in each roll of this deco foil. So each sheet will cover two pieces of the six by six paper. So I took one sheet and cut it down to six by six, and I turned my machine on using the little button back here, and then I put it on four. You can change the heat setting by pushing this button and when it turns green it's ready. So this is the little transfer folder. So I'm going to take my pattern paper, put it in the transfer folder, and then carefully cover it up completely using the foil. Because if there's any, stop Abby, sorry my dog's pushing on my arm. <laughs> if there's any pattern paper with toner on it that is showing through and not covered up by the foil, it will transfer to your folder and like stain your folder. So you have to make sure that it's covered up completely. So I've got it in there and it's covered up and now I'm just going to stick it in the machine and let it do its thing. Okay so now it's come through and I'm just going to cool it off just a teeny bit and then peel off the foil to reveal the foil design. Isn't that gorgeous? This is what it looks like up close. So now I'm going to do the other one, and I'm going to do it exactly the same way. I'm just going to line up my paper on my, or my foil on my paper, put it in the transfer folder, make sure there's no wrinkles, and then stick it through. Okay, so now it's done. I'm going to cool it off again, and then do the same thing. And there we go, foiled pattern paper. So that's how you use the Mini Mink machine. Very easy. It's a wonderful little machine and it works a lot better than my laminator. As you can tell, everything is foiled. There's no spots that didn't come or that didn't foil completely. So I really like it. There are two different Mini Minks. There's one by Anna Griffin and then this one by Hottie Swap. Um, and I think they're both about the same price point. This one looks like it's a little smaller than the Anna Griffin one, but you can get them both online. And I'll leave links to where you can buy them in the description box below. So thanks for watching guys. I will see you next time. Bye.